Hey, WW Universe, it's Ryan here. Survivor Series War Games has come and gone, and for the men's War Games, the Bloodline and Sami Zayn actually won. And yeah, I'm talking about uh, Sami Zayn just as well, too, in this video. How sincere he was to the Bloodline, and how uh, well he actually was cooperated with uh, Roman Reigns, Jimmy Uso, Jay, and Solo at the same time. Two nights after Survivor Series War Games, here we are once again in the middle of the ring with uh, Jay Uso and Sami Zayn. Finding out uh, where they actually stand in the bloodline. But if you notice on uh, the left-hand side, Solo is has his arms all folded. What is this a sign? It, throughout this uh, segment, it just seems like he Solo feels, uh, feels a little different. And Sami Zayn still trying to get along with uh, Jay. Does that hug really represent what we actually saw at Survivor War Games? Is that actually with Sami Zayn and Jay Uso still? See, this is the look we've been getting for the last couple months with Jay Uso. With Sam and Zane, and plus us, the WWE Universe, as well, too. I would like to know where Roman Reigns actually is throughout all this. It seems like the uh, Usos and Solo are together all the time with uh, Sam and Zayn. Where is Roman Reigns? Why he's, is he not appearing on both uh, shows? I know Roman Reigns is most likely on Friday Night SmackDown because he, he's that's where he's supposed to be, but he does have both of those belts, which is meaning. Shouldn't he be on both shows? See, you see Sammy and uh, Jimmy here playing all around. It's, so far, those two have been getting along uh, together. But the big question is about Roman Reigns. Where is he? But this is the big thing I like about this uh, segment as well, too, because uh, they were tr giving themselves a, a hug. Uh, Jim, Sammy uh, invited uh, Jimmy and Jay together to give him hugs. But Solo was some uh, a reason why. Why was he not being part of this big hug? What's going on here? I really did like this segment on what happened uh, this Monday at Monday Night Raw. I thought it was pretty close to what I, we actually saw with being Usi about Sam and being Usi and Jay just as well too. <laughs> that whole segment was pretty cool. They kind of uh, broke character and it, it was fun to actually see. But the big question here is where does a solo stand uh, with the bloodline? He seemed to be fine at Survivor Series War Games. And that's the other thing too. How well can we actually trust Sam and Zayn? How well can uh, the bloodline still trust him? Because we now know the bloodline now trusts Sam and Zane since he attacked his best friend, Kevin Owens. But where does this actually stand? I feel something's still going to happen here. This bloodline has been around for quite a while. And I think it might be time that we might see a separation. It may happen all the way up until the next WrestleMania. And maybe a possible match with this as well, too. Because I feel Sam and Zane and Kevin Owens still get along well. It's just a matter of when it's going to happen and when it's going to happen which will probably be WrestleMania of next year. And maybe uh, they could be going after uh, the Usos uh, tag team belts. So what do you guys actually think? Leave some comments down below. Love to hear what you guys got to say. But anyways, I'm going to start wrapping things up. Say my name is Ryan. Thank you for watching. Make sure to give me a thumbs up, subscribe. And I'll see you back for more wrestling talk. Thank you for watching. Bye.